Hello there guys, it's the Xeno Hunter 83 here with my mountain bridge tutorial. Okay, so starting off for the centre guys, but what we need to do is we need to go two blocks square, as you can see. We then need to count six blocks, and then we need to do another uh, six block square. Once we've done that, we need to get the chiselled stone brick and just stack up five blocks. Just do exactly what I'm doing guys. Also remember, if I'm going too fast, you can pause at any time. Just take your time with it and make sure that you get it right. Okay, so once we've done that, we want to start bringing the uh, bridge shape out, making the rough shape for the bridge. So we want to come out two blocks in the middle and then drop it down another two. Just do exactly the same on each side, guys. So two blocks, two blocks down. Then on the edges, we want to go down one block pull it out three and then one in the middle. Just do exactly what I'm doing guys as I say. It's a bit of a tricky build this one but it, it'll look really good on your map so it's well worth the effort. So obviously we're getting the stone um, steps now and we're just filling in all of the gaps. Obviously just doing the edges as well. So you just want to do exactly what I'm doing. Okay, so once we've done that, we then want to bring the steps down on the outside. So these are going to be the steps for the actual bridge itself. Obviously, if you're building this on a super flat, then you just you, you'd only be going from one um, one of the stone blocks. You'd only have one of the stone blocks. So just bear that in mind, guys. I'm trying to tie this into the landscape that I've got, so. Okay, so I mean now we've got the rough shape of the bridge. We're going to start putting some detail into it As I say guys just follow exactly what I do So we're just putting the the insides in for the the little arches that we're going to have And we're only using four blocks on this build So yeah, I mean it will work in any texture part of this Because we're only using the four blocks So these steps now are just going to give the um, the little arches some shape. Okay. So obviously guys, just keep zooming out, having a look at what you've got. It doesn't look too clever at the minute, but it will do once we've got the detail on it. Okay, so all we want to start doing now is just pulling the uh, steps out do it exactly how I'm doing it. Some of them you'll notice are, are, are kind of like tucked in at the corners, others are coming out straight so just just bear that in mind when you're doing it guys because it will affect how the build will look. Do exactly the same on the other side. start pulling them down so obviously that one's straight that one's tucked in and this is just going to give us the shape of the actual arches also guys if you do find this video uh, useful please make sure to leave me a like it just shows me that you're enjoying the content and that and encourages me to do more of these tutorials as I say I've got loads of builds loads of build ideas and that um, so yeah Okay, so I mean as you can see now we're just um, adding some more detail with the steps like I say just just do exactly what I do guys I'm not going to tell you how to place this step place that step is you know you can see what I'm doing So just follow exactly what I'm doing guys. Obviously we're on the uh, cobblestone wall now That's just going to give us some extra detail. You just want to do exactly what I'm doing there And we want to switch back onto the steps we're just going to do a little pattern going up next to the uh, the wall. All we're doing is we're just adding detail here. So just do exactly the same on the other side. And 
top bit just like that so it does actually tie into that top step there that won't be an issue because we'll we'll um, we'll put a wall on that later on it's exactly the same just follow the pattern bring it out starting to get a bit of shape now obviously a bit of depth a bit of detail so we're just getting the steps now and we just want to go on the top place two obviously we're just doing exactly the same as we've done on the other side remember guys as I say you can pause the video at any time you know I try to I try to make these videos flow as, uh, as as fast and as smooth as possible so you're not going to be able to build it at the same speed as it's being built on this there we go so we just tied it in there now obviously I am going to go where uh, I'm going to tie it all in for my build. If you're building on a super flat, remember you only want the one block of stone before you start placing any of the other blocks. Okay, so obviously we're just doing the upside down steps there on top of the uh, cobblestone wall. Again with the cobblestone wall. Just copy exactly what I'm doing. Okay. Then want to get the step and just cap off the higher ones. With the stone wall in the centre, just want to do that. Uh, it just gives it a little bit more extra shape. Obviously that's the centre of the bridge, so it just gives it a little bit more of a finishing touch. Okay guys, so obviously we've got the other side to do, now just follow exactly the same. We want it identical on the other side. I'm not showing that in this video, just for the sake of keeping the video short. As I say, it's exactly the same, so like if you need to, just rewind the video, start it from the beginning again, and just continue. Now I'm just making sure that the build's tied in properly. Yeah, now obviously if you are building it, you know, in between a mountain uh, and another mountain, um, you know, obviously you just want to shape the uh, the land around so it just fits in nicely so it just suits the um, you know so it just flows to the build type of thing that's all I'm gonna do but when I finish this I'll just tie it all in nicely um, obviously if you're on a super flat then there's no need to worry about that because um, you know you'll just be going from one edge to the other type of thing but I think this bridge would look really nice like um, on a flat piece of land with some um, you know like maybe a, a stream running running through the uh, arches type of thing but obviously the terrain that I'm building it on um, is already made I'm not going to put a stream in because there's nowhere for it to go so as you can see now guys all I'm doing is I'm just tying it in just finishing it off um, with the steps what I'm going to do as well and um, because obviously I've got a bit more um, space to play with I'm gonna like um, make the cobblestone wall drop down a bit more in the center and um, it just gives it a little bit more extra detail obviously if you're building on a super flat you can't do that but I mean just as it was it looked nice so obviously I'm just making sure there that the um, it's all tucked in steps 
that's one thing I do like about the step blocks is that you know that's why you use them quite a lot is because you know you can um, get some really good shapes from the steps because they're adaptable just make sure guys as well obviously to zoom out check what you're doing make sure you've got it right you'll see me do do it in a sec and realize that I've got a bit wrong so as you can see they're not actually even on those two sides they're slightly different so I need to just quickly go and fix that which I'm gonna do Yeah, so I just need to change that. Easily done. Yeah, this is actually the first bridge I've ever built, so I think you can allow me a mistake. Okay, so I mean that's how it look, looks guys. Obviously it should look like that on both sides. That's what the top should look like. I've just got a bit of um, stone half slab just to give it a little bit more definition. Okay, so I mean I'm just going to um, have a quick fly around now. Check that everything's right. And that's what you need to do guys. Just you know if, that, if that's one tip that I could pass on it's just like always zoom out have a look compare things and that think to yourself is there any way I can make it look better you know and that is how like you'll get your builds as good as they can be is by just like taking a bit of extra time and care with them okay so obviously I'm just shaping the landscape here to suit the build easily done it's easier to mess around with the landscape than it is to mess around with the build so obviously take that into account as I say all I'll do is I'll uh, I'll have a path going up now from that or coming down from the tower that'll just meet with that Okay guys, so we're just going to have a look now at what it looks like full screen. I think it looks pretty nice to be honest with you. Um, also, yeah, obviously if you do enjoy the video guys, please make sure to leave me a like, drop me a comment. If you've got any requests for builds or any feedback, anything like that, it's all appreciated at the end of the day. Um, so we're just, yeah, just having a look now. I think that works pretty well. Not bad for my first bridge. Obviously, I've just passed this 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 knowledge straight on to you guys. I think it, it complements the tower pretty well. That it would be nice if it had a stream flowing down it, though. I must admit, it's just that there'd be nowhere for the stream to go. I mean, I suppose I could have actually made it so there's a stream running into the sea. To be fair. From the cliff but maybe I will do that at a later date but anyway guys thank you very much for watching I hope you've enjoyed the tutorial we're gonna have a little picture now of the Minecraft Builders Guild you can post any of your build pics on that that's on PlayStation 4 but until the next time guys peace <laughs>